What is going on guys? How are we all doing? I just wanted to make this quick video uh, just to kind of give an update on uh, what's going on right now. So for those of you who do know or don't know, we are currently in Florida and we're actually in Tampa right now. And uh, yeah, there's a little um, storm coming, Hurricane Irma. So I just wanted to give uh, our update on that, our thoughts and uh, our current situation. Now, this hurricane is not going to be anywhere as near as bad as people once feared it would be. Now, it started off at a Category 4, then went to a Category 5. Now it's like a Category 3, going to about, about to go down to a Category 2. And by the time, you know, it hits the Tampa area, it's probably looking like a low to Category 2, maybe even a Category 1. So, you know, the hurricane itself is not going to be anywhere near as bad as anyone um, first thought. So, you know, with the lowered wind speed you know the, you know it's not completely safe you know we're not just gonna you know, you, we can't just run outside you know when you've still got like 70 80 90 um mile per hour wind you know it's probably not safe to go out driving and that's why uh places businesses restaurants all that stuff is uh, still gonna be staying closed um probably for the next couple of days um but it's not going to be you know we're not going to get buildings destroyed and all that stuff. You know, I mean, if you're staying in a mobile home, then, you know, you might experience some damage. But we're staying in a four-story concrete um, hotel. So that should be, you know, we should be pretty safe as far as the hurricane is concerned. Now, the other thing is the storm surge. And what that is, is um, the increase... Uh, sea levels um, and they're expecting it to be six to eight feet maximum um, now if you take into consideration the amount of rainfall there's going to be you know it could be could be up to 10 feet maximum um, so you know that's and that's on the high end as well but we are currently situated um, you know a decent level above sea you know, I'm pretty sure about this hotel, it's, um, I'm pretty sure it's like 60 to 70 feet above sea level. So given, you know, the 10 feet rise maximum of sea level, we shouldn't be affected by that. So, you know, all in all, the reduced hurricane uh, wind speeds, you know, and the fact that this storm surge, you know, is not going to affect the whole of Tampa it's only going to be affecting you know the low-lying areas around uh, around the coast you know we're going to be fine I'm pretty confident um, but I just wanted to give my um, thoughts I just wanted to give an update for anyone who's worried and uh, let me show you out the window real quick so it's around seven o'clock now yeah so it's around seven o'clock now and this is what we are looking at outside Obviously not too windy, you know, wind speeds are probably like 30 miles per hour at the moment. So, uh, yeah, it's all looking pretty uh, fine and dandy out there. There's a little bit of rain, a little bit of wind. But we are expected to get the brunt of the hurricane, I think around 2 a.m. So that's when we will, uh, you know, start to get the um, 80, 90 miles per hour winds maximum. Um, and then it won't be till after that when we start to get the storm surges. But this has just been a quick update video. We're fine, we're gonna be okay. Um, you know, we're not planning on running out of here. I appreciate anyone who has been concerned, appreciate the messages and whatnot, but uh, yeah, we're gonna be just fine.